Hello there everybody, it is me Feaser Bunny and welcome to my overview slash first impressions on the second stuff pack for The Sims 4 Perfect Patio Stuff. Okay guys, so this stuff pack has been announced about a week ago during the release of Newcrest and I'm actually very surprised to see that the first two stuff packs for The Sims 4 have been released about a month away from each other. It's really really interesting. I can't wait to see what's in store um, and see what like EA has in plan for us. But anyway, Perfect Patio is a stuff pack that's very similar to Outdoor Retreat for The Sims 3 in which um, it basically opens up your patio and provides more activities for The Sims outdoors if you guys get what I mean and basically the star attraction for the stuff pack are hot tubs so I'm really really excited actually to get into that as a builder I'm so excited there's so much more possibilities um, and it's gonna be so exciting okay uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and read this to you guys. Welcome to the Sims 4 Perfect Patio Stuff. Relax in the all-new hot tub. Adults and children love soaking in the tub, while handy Sims will find a plethora of upgrades. Couples enjoy quiet moments together. To discover new romance, find it in build mode under the outdoor activities. Dress down to kick back. And yes, you guys, this stuff pack also come with a bunch of new create a sim items, which I'm also really excited about. Okay. From swimsuits to slim fit polos, choose from a collection of chic apparel, master the grill in the new kiss the cook apron, top off your sim's laid back look with new hairstyles, and finally, chill outside poolside, set up an open air lounge area by the pool with a variety of stylish furnishings and decor, heat things up on the new barbecue grill and serve up some refreshments at the patio bar. Okay, so we're going to go right into creating a sim and i will see you guys there in just a second Alrighty, guys we're back in create a sim and i have my get to work household with us here to test out all the create a sim items so let's actually go ahead and check this out okay um i don't think there's gonna be any new hairstyles and stuff okay guys so there are actually a couple of hairstyles that came with perfect patio stuff uh so there are one for each the men and the women so this is the hairstyle that came with the women and i actually really like it i like the very loose braid over here towards the forehead area i also like how the hair is kind of long in the front and short in the back i think that makes it look very modern i'm gonna go ahead and put it in a bunch of different colors for you guys um so yeah it's really really cute actually very summery vibe as well definitely very summery because it's a nice short hair style and yeah I really really like it and the hairstyle that actually came for the men I honestly don't like as much because it kind of makes the boys look a little bit older uh, or more mature um, I would definitely like this on my senior sims not necessarily on my you know young adult or kids and stuff now that we've gotten this out of the way let's go ahead and actually check out some new clothing uh, okay so let's see here um, these are things that I've unlocked from my get to work let's play by the way in case you guys didn't know uh, so let's actually filter the items and filter the perfect pat what okay oh oh this looks really interesting um definitely this thing probably came with perfect patio right because I've not seen this thing before um yep I'm pretty sure this came with perfect patio it's really cute I love the fact that it is a crop top I'm actually really excited I'm gonna put it in a bunch of different colors for you guys as well uh, it's very summery as well actually some of these colors can be very spring as well uh, but yeah I love this I'm totally gonna be putting this on my sims let's look at some bottoms if we have any um, I don't think okay these are not from perfect patio so let's just ignore those and then full body outfits I'm so excited I can see a bunch of new stuff already okay first one is this dress which is really really pretty it has a beautiful neckline it's actually very business casual if I do say so myself um yeah it's it, it's very nice um honestly I would not expect to get this from a perfect patio stuff pack but whatever it's kind of a more business futuristic but whatever I I like it I could see myself putting these on my sims especially like in this yellow color it looks really good uh, okay so yeah really really nice and then we have this one which I hope is also a swimsuit because it looks really cute um it 
it would actually make for a gorgeous gown as well if it was like floor length uh but yeah i saw this on the trail and i was like oh my god that is beautiful it's like you know grecian draped and stuff like that and i love the neckline as well it's a plunge v-neck gorgeous and it comes in a bunch of different colors i love it in the blue for some strange reason i and i think it would look okay also looks good in the white and you guys can see more of the detail as well over here on the straps and stuff it looks really nice actually and if you actually look closer it actually does not have it has like um some like what are these things called um i forgot the shorts uh, but yeah super super short shorts inside uh, what are those things hot pants i believe is what those those are called and also we have a brand new swimsuit now i'm pretty sure this thing is available as a swimsuit and it looks really gorgeous as well both of these have a very similar neckline it's like a plunge halter type of thing looks gorgeous in this color actually and i think it also looks good in the white uh, i love this so much i'm so happy it also looks really sexy as well so yeah i can't wait to actually throw a pool party for my sims just so someone can wear this and somebody can also wear this as an everyday interestingly enough and yeah and then finally we have this one shirt over here which is the cutest thing ever i'm totally gonna be putting this on my sim for get to work because this thing totally works with like the stuff and get to work if you have a shop i could totally see this apron thing coming into play and being very useful and all that good stuff i love it so much actually Especially in like this one um, And then the burger type of thing if you have a restaurant. It's really really awesome. Okay, so I guess that's it for all the do we have I don't think we're gonna have any new accessories and stuff um, Yeah, I don't think so uh, but let's go ahead and just make sure new shoes i don't think we're gonna have any as well okay so yeah that's it for all the new cast items i want to make sure okay let's also go ahead and actually check out the mail items first i mean next okay we have a really buff um cop over here <laughs> jace okay so it looks like we have a couple of new shirts for the boys um we have this one kind of button down which is really cute it's totally my style i love wearing these uh so yeah it's really really nice i like it in the pink actually i like seeing button downs with like shirts that are really really clean inside it makes you know it kind of makes it look more proper i guess but whatever uh, once again it has a very summery vibe and i love it in these pastel colors the pink yellow and this light blue actually it comes in a, a lot of really cute color this one looks like it could also be a denim one so it's really cute next up is this polo shirt oh my god and it is so tight fitting uh but yeah it's it's very very tight but i love it in this blue color it could also pass off as like a uh, um a business uniform actually i don't know i could see like an employee wear this really really good as well i love how a lot of these tops are very um timeless if you guys get what i mean and they're very easy to mix and match with other garments in the game as well Let's go ahead and look at some full body outfits. Okay, we can't. The men came with one apron, which is really cute. Um, once again, freaking adorable. I love the apron thing. I don't know what it has to do with, you know, perfect patio. Maybe um, if you have like a barbecue grill type of thing, um, I think it's really cool. But yeah, it's really, really cute. I love how it comes in a bunch of bright colors as well. So yeah, I'm so happy to see this garment available for the men as well. Um, I could have sworn I saw some shorts and stuff, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, there are some new shorts. And these are the cutest little things ever. I love these shorts so much. I wish these would come for the swimmer. Let's actually check that out. And yes, these come available for the swimmer. And they're so freaking cute. I love them so much. I love these. These are probably my favorite board shorts in the game. They're just the best. Okay, um, I'm also going to go ahead and actually check out whether we have some items for the kids as well. Uh, I don't think they have anything actually. Nope, it doesn't look like the kids have anything. I might be mistaken though. Yeah, it doesn't look like the kids have anything. So I'm going to go ahead and actually um, yeah, hop into Build by Mode and I will see you guys there in just a second. Okay guys? Alrighty guys, welcome back to Build by Mode and we are actually in Newcrest. So yeah, the new world that was released for the game. 
Um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys all the items that came for the builds by mode for this stuff pack, actually. And we're also going to test each and every one of them out. I don't think this stuff pack came with any gameplay, actually. So um, it's mostly going to be builds by mode items and stuff. Um, I actually want to see if it came with some new rooms. Cause oh yes, well, backyard confine. It costs eleven thousand simoleons to purchase a style. Okay, whatever. Uh, we all know, and it comes in a bunch of different colors as well. I really like it in just this default one. Let's go ahead and place this one. Uh, buy room and uh, how can we? Okay, there we go. Uh, let's actually rotate that as well. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited to actually get into the outdoors with this stuff pack. So that's the only room, I guess, that came with this stuff pack. Because the other stuff pack luxury party actually came with two styled rooms. But whatever, it works. Um, I'm more concerned about the items that came with this stuff pack. So I'm really, really excited to see those. Let's go ahead and filter them into the perfect patio i also noticed that all the stuff backs are colored in a nice green yellow green color okay yeah and it looks like we get one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve twenty four 29 almost 30 items okay i'm so freaking excited uh so first off we have a bunch of chairs this one and then we also have this one that's a bar stool these are some sofas oh my god i love these these are so modern these are so awesome i'm also working on like a pool venue by the way which i'm probably going to be uploading later this week over here you guys watch out for that i i, le I legit like saved some space on this venue for lugs i mean for perfect patio so yes, it's gonna be super exciting. Okay, so we have a bunch of chairs. I want to see these in a bunch of different colors. Actually, this is awesome. Um, okay, just put it in a bunch of different colors for you guys to see. These are so freaking cute, by the way. I love these. I'm pretty sure a lot of simmers out there are gonna like the fact that these are very modern. And oh, that's oh, this that's a dining table. Oh my god, this is so cute that coffee table is the best okay and we have a bunch of counters as well which are definitely geared towards the outside because you can see that um you guys can see that they actually have like an outdoorsy texture to them okay and we have a new umbrella awesome okay i'm gonna put it here so it doesn't block other people's way um change the color of that actually um I really really like this color and let's place in some chairs on that as well so you guys can see there we go you know what I like the simplicity of these like, these items you know they're very simple and I kind of like that you know that's it's 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 very modern and it's very elegant as well um, and we of course we have a new grill which I'm also really excited you know the thing is I've never really owned a grill in the Sims 4 and I'm really really excited to actually get myself into owning a grill for the first time and it comes in also a bunch of different colors as well this one the zero um, I'm guessing is probably um, is this a light or something Yes, it is in fact a light, which is so awesome. I love how it's like a different take on your usual outdoor lighting fixture. And I think these actually connect seamlessly. Yes, yes, they do. Okay, that's actually really nice. And of course, it comes in a bunch of nice little colors as well, like so. Uh, and then... Um, still a bunch of stuff that we need to be... Oh, uh, we have some chests. Um items as well i don't think these are interactable though i don't think the sims can actually play chess but they're nice decorative sculptures um this thing is like the cutest thing ever that is the best i like things that are simple like this you know you would see these in like your department store and stuff and i really like that you know i think it's it's more of a realistic furniture and of course we have some clutter as well once again it's so freaking exciting put those here give you guys a closer look at that it looks like it's like Worcestershire sauce or something like maybe soy sauce I don't know oh maybe it could be like some drinks as well and we have some wall ornaments over here the log roll I'm gonna put these over here out back um, see how these look 
and yep all of these are actually slices of wood you guys can see like it has like some rings and stuff which tells you like how old the wood is uh, it doesn't actually have a blue color which is quite surprising okay let's just do that and then um, we have this really really interesting das mesh but it oh it's a wall item as well okay once again it's very interesting I thought this this would be like a divider or something uh, so yeah go ahead and put these in a bunch of different colors as well uh, so you guys can see it properly and then this one is rack of thongs oh okay it's it's more kitchen clutter oh my what is this floors <gasps> no freaking way please tell me these light up please tell me these light up because that would be amazing um so i was actually reading a book about landscaping and i saw these things on like a main street and stuff and i was like those are freaking cool oh it doesn't look like they light up actually well, you know, that's a little bit of a bummer because I thought these would light up more, but you know, they, they kind of draw your attention to the ground, which is really, really awesome. I like how we're getting some unexpected items as well. And, uh, okay, let's go ahead and check out more. <laughs> we do get like 30 items if I counted correctly. What is this? Whoa, what is this? Oh my gosh, what the hell is this? Um, I think this is just a sculpture, but wow, this is very um, eye-catching. <laughs> okay, oh my gosh, these are so beautiful. That's like a yin and yang type of thing. And of course, we have our hedges as well. Um, uh, these have a little bit more detail than the ones that we have currently in the game, so I'm really, really happy to see these. Uh, a bunch of different colors as well. Oh my god, yes, I love... I love this plant. This is probably like my new favorite plant because uh, it looks freaking awesome and it does look like a legit freaking oh my god and it comes in some crazy cray cray colors. Talk about freaking Katy Perry color scheme but whatever okay. Uh, but I love this plant so much. I feel like these two plants are gonna be my new favorites and I'm definitely gonna be using these a lot in my future builds. Uh, so yeah wink wink watch out for those. Okay we cannot afford the hot tub so i'm gonna go ahead and actually mother load so we can afford them there we go simple cheat okay uh before we move on to the hot tubs the last remaining items we have are actually some um bars as well which are awesome these actually match with the counters that um came with this stuff pack as well so that's really exciting put that there and i'm gonna show you guys the bar stools that attach to this as well there we go okay now it's time for the piece de resistance okay uh yes you guys the focal points the star attraction of this freaking stuff pack are hot tubs yes hot tubs are finally back and we didn't have to wait for like an entertainment themed expansion pack to get hot tubs we get them right off the bat we have the left off center hot tub over here which is a more angular one it has like 90 degree angles and stuff it's definitely um very very easy to incorporate go ahead and show you guys a bunch of different colors the blue one actually looks really nice i don't know why uh and i really like the white color as well and also we have the second hot tub which is the more expensive oh actually no this is the cheaper one surprisingly a pringos heater hot tub and it is 1500 simoleons um i don't know why this would be more expensive but I, whatever it works and it comes in also a bunch of different colors uh it looks really particularly nice in the wooden color okay so yeah, let's go ahead and actually get our sims into these hot tubs. Of course, everybody is going to change into their freaking swimwear. Uh, that This sim is an alien, by the way. Okay, let's change into their swimwear. Uh, for once, I actually get to see my sims in their swimwear. After playing this get to work family for like, how many months already? Uh, yeah, let's swimwear. And then go. She needs to. Oh yeah, hell yeah, and then she also needs to change into her swimmer as well. I actually want everyone to go over here instead, because I think that this would be a more cooler um, get in together. Uh, move here. And then, oh yeah, everyone is going in, everyone is getting in. 
hell yeah. I wonder how many sims can fit. I should have actually made a child so we can see like, um... Oh, and it looks like a, a lot of sims can actually fit in. It looks like you can fit in your whole household actually, so... This is so freaking exciting actually. I'm so freaking excited, you guys. Um... Yeah, and my sims look freaking classy as fuck. I have to bleep that, but whatever. Uh, let's actually look at the interactions here that come with a hot sub. Okay. Admire new possession, skinny dip. Um, set light color, and that's pretty much it. I could have sworn I read, like, some other interactions. Oh, there are some romantic interactions as well. Oh, can she not get in? Yeah, she can. not Okay. Uh, oh. Why did you get out? I don't think... Maybe, I think it has like a maximum 4 sims, I don't know. Let's actually see if it works with 5 sims, get in together. Okay, actually yeah, we can actually fit in a lot of sims. So this is really exciting, I love how there's also like a television over there as well, it's really really awesome. Anyway, you know what you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and actually keep this part short for you guys. Um, but yeah, that's my quick overview on the second stuff back for The Sims 4. I'm actually really, really excited to see what they dish out because I feel like the stuff backs are gonna come per month. I'm not so sure though. This does cost a little bit more expensive here in the Philippines where I live. It's 12 US dollars. I do believe it's like 9.99 in the, in the, in the USA or whatever. Uh, but whatever, anyway. Um, so for $12, I honestly think that it's worth it. I love all the builds by mode items and I also love the fact that we get quite a bit of really, really awesome creative stim items as well. If I had to rate this out of 10, I would probably give it about an 8 out of 10. Uh, cause other than the hot, actually no, I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10. I love the hot tubs. Uh, but other than the hot tubs, I kind of wish that it introduced, like, some more gameplay. Maybe, like, an extra item uh, that gave us a little bit more gameplay. I don't know. That's probably just me. But, you know, 7 out of 10 is actually a really, really good, um, you know, number for me. It's a really good impression on me. So, I'm really, really happy that I, that I got this. And I assure you guys that I'm going to be using this stuff pack a lot. But, anyway... Before I actually wrap this review up, I, I want to go ahead and actually say um, a shout out to a couple of you guys out there. Um, so first of all, I just want to say hi and happy birthday to Angela Apperly. Um, I'm about a day late for this because her birthday, I believe, was on the 15th. And right now it's the 16th. So happy birthday, Angela. Belated happy birthday. I hope you had a great day. Thank you so much for all the support. And yeah. I hope you enjoyed this review and also I want to say a big thank you to a very very long time subscriber from me and it is for Mew Kawaii. Her original name was IZ Bookmark by the way. I love you girl. You know, you know who you are. Um, I'm so proud of your YouTube channel and I just want to say that thank you so much for the video. I'm so touched by everything that you said about me. I'm actually going to go ahead and link her video about me in the description below if you guys are interested in that just because um, she is really, really awesome. And I'm so appreciative of the fact that she um, shared, you know, how I impacted her life. And it made me so happy. I was literally going to cry. It made my day. Um, so yeah, I dedicate this review to you, IZ Bookmark. So thank you. Thank you for everything. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for my overview slash first impressions on the second stuff pack for The Sims 4. Um, once again, you guys, please don't forget to hit that like, favorite, and subscribe button because it's really going to help out this channel a lot. You all have an awesome, awesome, awesome day. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.